I'm Sheila Janet, aka Butterscotch, and I'm the creative director of Butterscotch Owl. Um, I'm a visual artist based here in Amsterdam, um, creating my own fantasy. My house is my, my island, actually. So I build like a set with all pieces that I find online that are um, my inspiration. So like books, I have like a full on black Playboy archive that is like in my coffee table. I have Chippendale uh, calendars. For instance, my bedroom is just like a scene of Blanche in The Golden Girls. So for me to keep being inspired, I need to be surrounded in my own inspirational space. So for me, my home is my um, inspirational archive. Literally, my mom called me Sheila Janet, like Sheila E from Prince and the drumster, uh, Janet Jackson. This is like my biggest inspiration. I saw my mom with her makeup and all my aunts with them, their makeup, with their black aesthetics. For me, it's showing black excellence and yeah, visualize it in nowadays fashion. So um, being this um, persona and creating butterscotch out really made like a distinguished style. Uh, because it's a reference of the 80s, it's a nostalgic feeling if you look at it. People have their own, they are drawn to it because they all have their little nostalgic feeling looking towards Butterscotch Owl. So I have a big audience, people like it. It's aesthetically uh, really soothing. For baby suit brands, I have been doing uh, campaigns because they have such an iconic uh, swimsuit uh, culture. shoots, I do art direction, um, sometimes I do creative direction for other things I don't even shoot myself. So yeah, but, yeah, I'm happy. So I look for my inspiration in um, black culture and that can be in the past or present. Uh, for the past, for instance, uh, Grace Jones is a big one, Naomi Campbell, um, named them Janet Jackson, all these iconic females, but for now, for the present, I always look at um, yeah, the common blackness, like, um, like dancehall queens, parties, like, like in a party, if I go to like an all black music party, I look at people, like the girls' nails, their attire, like I just love the unapologetically blackness and um, and the loudness of their style and it's for me my biggest inspiration and I would love to channel that in my work so it's not just mainstream but mainstream by a black woman. I learned that you just have to trust what you want to create and do it. You don't have to own all the skills um, that you think you need to have to do a certain thing like I began actually start, wanted to start a bathing suit line because I knew what would be popping. But yeah, trying to do that in the like the journey, trying to do that, I found out that I really just love to create the fantasy of like wearing bathing suits in the 80s and the iconic beach uh, culture. And that, that for me was more um, my thing. So I just started to create uh, images, and I am, I, I always said I was not a photographer, I was not a stylist, I was not a, but I'm all of it because I just do it, and um, your own uh, creative mind is your um, professional trait. That is what your worth is. So if you just start doing your thing, um, unprofessionally, you will create your own craft. So I do the art direction, um, actually the photography with Ricardo, um, but I'm in charge. So I know uh, um, what lighting, what frame, um, makeup, 
super specific because I do it myself. So nails, like even like these nails, I did it everything myself. Um, the shape needs to be like this and everything I do in post-production as well. So I really go into every detail so it becomes my fantasy and not like someone else's. No, it needs to be my fantasy. So I geek on every little thing, my hair, everything I do myself. It's like a do-it-yourself thing. And Ricardo is my creative consultant. He knows my mind. Yeah, that's, that's why um, my work is my work. The most important thing is to have um, friends and people you work with that lift you up. Uh, I am me because of my friends that help me creating my images and they know and they, be they believe in me. So to have like a, a safe space with your friends and to be super free in creating, um, that's the most inspirational and like the best work, work environment you can create for yourself and for others. I would not even be me without the Ricardo or like the people where I can like go to the studio to. They see me for me, so see people for who they are and be your authentic self, always.